Hello guys, welcome back to another video. So today in this video, we'll be talking about rhombic antennas. So what do you mean by rhombic antennas? Well, let's find out. So here, just like the name suggests rhombic antenna, a rhombic antenna is having the shape of a rhombus. A rhombus is a two-dimensional shape which has got four equal sides, just like a diamond. So, so here, in the case of a rhombic antenna, this is how a rhombic antenna looks like. So here, this is a particular rhombus. So it has got four sides, four equal sides and therefore representing the shape of a rhombus. And now each side of this particular rhombic antenna is referred to as the length of that particular antenna. So now here, in this case, one end of this particular antenna is fed to a particular transmission line as a feeder while the other end is terminated with a non-inductive resistor. So therefore this is how a particular rhombic antenna looks like. So now if you are drawing the lobe diagram of this particular rhombic antenna, it would look somewhat like this. It would have a major lobe in this direction and certain side lobes or minor lobes in the direction in which it is not intended to propagate that is in the other direction so therefore from this we can observe that this particular rhombic antenna has got a direction of propagation in this particular direction so the line joining the feed point and this particular resistance value this particular line is referred to as the axis of this particular rhombic antenna. So the angle made by this particular major lobe and this particular axis is referred to as beta. So beta is the angle made by this major lobe with respect to this particular axis that is the axis of this particular rhombic antenna. So here the terminating resistance, uh, the value of this terminating resistance can vary from around 600 ohm to around 800 ohms. So therefore this thus gives you a brief introduction as in how a rhombic antenna looks like and the basic concepts behind a rhombic antenna. So here in the case of rhombic antenna it is a very slow traveling wave radiator. So here it is in the shape of a rhombus, so that is four long wires connected in the form of a diamond or a rhombus structure in the horizontal plane above the ground. So here one end of the antenna is fed through a balanced transmission line as a particular feeder while the other end is terminated with a non-inductive resistor. The angle made by the main lobe and the particular axis is referred to as beta. This type of antenna it is used for wide frequency frequency band and the terminating resistor can vary from 600 to 800 ohms. So here the design equations can be written like this h is equal to lambda by 4 sin beta where beta is the angle made by the main lobe with the axis and l is equal to lambda by 2 sin squared beta and phi is equal to 90 minus beta. This thus sums up what you mean by a rhombic antenna. I hope you guys now have a brief and clear idea as in what rhombic antennas are and how the structure of a particular rhombic antenna looks like. So we'll be discussing much more about the further topics in this module in the upcoming videos. So stay tuned and I'll see you guys in the next video. Thank you.